song is called Lost and Found. friend of a friend who was a really amazing guitarist and she was at the time she was 19 and she'd been playing since she was about seven and when I saw her play I'd never seen anyone play like that and I just I don't know I really responded to it and I wanted to kind of I just wondered if I could do it as well um, and so I started playing at the age of about 18 um, inspired by her. Lyrically, I guess anything that's happening in my life, I, I find that I write about my own situations. Um, so the, the albums come out very autobiographical. Um, and musically, um, all kinds of things, like Jill Scott, for example. Um, I loved Lauren Hill's voice when I was growing up. And I love jazz guitar. I love... Um, I love Nina Simone, I love all kinds of things. <laughs> this is my interpretation of a Jill Scott song, <laughs> um, and it's my favourite one, one of my favourites, it's uh, He Loves Me. You love me, feel special, live different, ever. Is Your Love Big Enough? It, for me, um, it was written actually about just me having a really great time in New York. It came after a time, after a long period of having not written any songs and um, that was getting me down. So I came out here so I could just kind of see what happened really and try and be um, creative. I'd love to sing with Stevie Wonder one day, um, or I don't know Prince, or Erica Badu, or Little Dragon, um, or maybe make some beats with Jay-Z <laughs> or something. And I've got one more song prepared now, so I thought it'd be appropriate for it to be the title track of the album. So, thanks for having me. This is called, Is Your Love Big Enough? She is called Connie, um, as in Constance, uh, which I, that was my grandmother's name. So I thought it would be kind of fitting for, for my favourite guitar to be called. Connie. 